right. <clears throat> April 30th, 2020. 520 in the afternoon. Out at uh, Heron Airport. Checking out November 1 for Tangle Foxtrot. We're getting ready to systematically disassemble the baffling the wire spark the ignition wiring <clears throat> and we're going to remove the oil cooler and remove all that replace all the <clears throat> rubber hoses and flex hoses the heater hose here is rotted it's uh you can see down in there that that's wide open so that any exhaust could have been creeping up in there and getting carbon monoxide. The whole thing's not sealed. The the cold air inlet cold air inlet that goes here to the heater baffle then comes out and goes in. All of that was dis in disarray and not connected. And so the real strong potential of uh there'd been an exhaust leak or whatever to get carbon monoxide poisoning, that simple. And the air, this tube here is the vent at, to create vacuum for the heater system. So the air coming in now with it hooked up will be rammed in, ram air in and around and inside. And then with vacuum on the tube on the bottom going out. So it creates a heat exchanger system inside and we've got all new hoses um, intake hoses here's a heater duct hose for one of them and uh new hoses <clears throat> excuse me cylinder wrenches everything we're getting ready to do top overall we're going to change all that out all this <clears throat> the cylinders pistons and rings i got treated at cryo heat and there will be Probably shipped out today or tomorrow and get here sometime next week. All six cylinders. And then what I plan to do is send oil cooler, the baffling, um, more than likely the connecting rods and the um, rocker arms will get sent out for treatment and then put new bushings in them. I'll send, I'll order the bushings too. So I'll send, so all new bushings will get sent in. And the bushings also get cryo heat. I'm going to send the exhaust in. So we're going to remove the exhaust up underneath, coming down. All this is going to come out. We have new exhaust tailpipes. And this has all got to come off to change the cylinders. So we're going to really take a strong, hard look at the whole exhaust system. Uh, the heat baffle, then the, I think it's got a little resonator on it. We'll check that out, get that sent in, get a micro polished, get it heat treated, and then uh, possibly send it out for coating. We'll see. Uh, that's probably my plan to get it coated. Um, this is going to get vapor blasted. It looks going to look like brand new when they're done. And, um, cryo heat treated. So all of the cryo heat, so the cylinders and all that's being cryo heated. Uh, hopefully I'm going to send the spark plugs. I ordered the wrong spark, spark plugs. I ordered with the barrel, the larger barrel. And I have the, that's what I have on the, the Baron. And then on this, we have the smaller the smaller connected piece. So I got the wrong size barrel. So aircraft spruce is gonna let me send in all but one because I opened it. It wasn't until I opened the package that I realized it was the wrong size. So once I cut that open, I owned that spark plug for 30 bucks, whatever it was, 20 something. So I'm gonna send those in and they're gonna charge me a 15% restocking fee plus the minus of the spark plug that I opened. And then I'll have to pay all that again and get new and uh, get the new set of spark plugs. And I'd like to send the spark plugs and get those cryo heated as well because I think they would make them last so much longer. 
this, so I'm really going all out on the cryo heat process. I want to um, uh, really go for it and see what kind of been, I think is going to see a profound benefit. But we'll let it go at that. And I'm going to uh, drain the oil, start the process, get the oil cooler out, and tag all tag all the wire spark wires and then start moving the heat shields baffling clean those all up yeah this is all gonna look so much better too um once we get that set up i'll when also their balance, all six cylinders is set to balance. So I'm going to double check the balance. I'm going to balance, make sure. And then the connecting rods, I'm going to balance the connecting rods and get them all true so that the system is all within, I'd like to get it all within a gram of each other. Um, but at, the, but the minimum spec is two grams per, no different than two gram per side on, on opposing cylinders. So it could be six grams total difference between cylinders from bank to bank, two grams only between opposing. So that'll, uh, oh yeah. So we'll uh, we'll get this taken apart. These are the older cast number heads. We got new ca newer cast numbers that were cast in the 80s. So these are the older cast cylinders. And what I'll do is I may look at sending these in and get them vapor blasted and cryo heated if they're rebuildable and then have a rebuilt set and possibly sell it or put it on a rebuilt engine. But I would, if, anyway, so I'm going to do also on the other cylinders that are coming in, I'm going to do a little port and polish, just kind of gasket match and do a little, you know, not a lot of porting. But mainly about 20% and 80% is polishing or you know, smoothing it out, just cleaning it up. I'm not going to get too aggressive on the port, but there's a lot of cap. When I looked at them, there's a lot of casting ridges and just all kinds of stuff in the way of the airflow. So cleaning those up, those cylinder heads, after they've been cryo heated, should really make those heads flow. This thing really should just hum like a baby. <laughs> And we'll uh, kind of let it go from there. I'm not sure how far this, how much shielding we got to take off back here versus what, you know, to get the head of the cylinders off. I hope they won't have to disconnect too much. I will also, if I can, I will just double check all the torque on the through bolts as well. Just make sure it's all set nice and tight and even. Okay. <clears throat> I'm thinking of, uh, this, this plane reminds me a lot of uh, the F-117 stealth fighter. And I'm thinking of paint eventually stripping. If I'm going to paint it, I'm going to strip it. I'm going to, I might paint it as close to it as possible. Hi, come on in. I'm just doing some video on this. I'll shut her down. Getting ready 